We've all heard the phrase, those who fail to learn from history are doomed to repeat it. The meaning behind this phrase is that you will make the same mistakes if you aren't careful. David Chappette, an editorial cartoonist for the New York Times, created a cartoon about that. In his cartoon, the dialogue between two people depicts his view of the political climate in Europe, a glimpse into Europe's dark past or its future. Through the use of perspective, dialogue, and body language in the image, David Chappette creates an effective argument. The perspective of the image is similar to what you would see in a theater. It's as if Chappette is saying, watch what's happening, and make Europe the center of attention. The continent is bright red, immediately drawing attention. The far out zoom enforces the idea that it is not an isolated occurrence. The rest of the image is shadowed and in black and white. This shows that other nations should watch the unfolding events in Europe to gauge the potential impacts in their own country. The dialogue written in the cartoon implies there are parallels to be drawn between modern far-right groups and former regimes. Chappette makes it obvious that he is referring to the far-right with the sign that says far-right. He also wrote the names of different countries on flags. This refers to the high amounts of nationalism supported by far-right groups. Nationalism was a key component in the First World War and the formation of the Third Reich. Nationalism allows citizens to see their country as perfect and blameless, which can fuel discrimination. The body language of the people in the cartoon represents people cheering, like you'd see at a sporting event. This demonstrates rising levels of nationalism in European politics. A person is also performing a Nazi salute, which refers to fascist sentiments found among some members of far-right groups. These sentiments can be seen in racist, anti-Islamic, and anti-immigration rhetoric used by members of these groups. Pat effectively argues that Europe is showing similarities to former regimes on the continent by using the perspective of a theater, dialogue between figures in the cartoon, and the body language of people in the cartoon. If we don't learn from the mistakes Europe made in the past, we may make them again.